Bienvenidos and welcome. My name is Crossbite, and today we're going to be looking at how to pull in streaming video of your friends so you can use that for collaborations and streaming with live interaction. So, all you need to do is go to obs.ninja from your favorite web browser. You don't need any additional software for this, just go to the website and you're going to click on Add Your Camera to OBS. It's going to grab your default camera. Uh, mine is currently in use by VC Face, so I can bring this beautiful video to you. So you may get an error like this if your camera is in use. And as you see, there I am in VC Face, and that's why I'm getting that error. If you have VC Face open, you're going to want to go ahead and go to your settings and scroll down and enable the virtual camera. You're also going to want to load in a solid color background, uh, blue screen, green screen, magenta, whatever your preferred color is. I'm going to use green screen just for the purposes of this video, but whatever is appropriate for you. And we're going to go back to obs.ninja and we're going to switch that over to our VC based camera. You're going to see that the image is reversed, but don't worry about that. It will be correct once you load it into Streamlabs or OBS. And if you're using your microphone, feel free to choose the appropriate option. I'm going to be using Discord for my microphone options, so I'm not going to go ahead and use that today. You do have a few different camera options. I like to go with balanced. I feel that that works pretty well. So that's what we're going to go with this time as well. So you can see there I am with my green screen on, and up at the top I've got a web link. You can just click on that to get the web link copied, or you can select it and choose Control-C or right-click and copy if you so choose. I also want to note you do have some options at the bottom like muting or hanging up the call or those types of things, so feel free to check those out if you need those for anything. Uh, but today we're just going to go ahead and just kind of show you how this works and we're going to kind of just do a high level. So I have Streamlabs OBS open here, as you can see. Let me go ahead and choose whatever scene I need. I'm going to go ahead and choose a new source of a web browser, browser source, and I'm going to go ahead and at the bottom, I'm going to add a new one. I'm going to name this OBS Ninja for our reference today. And as I create that, I'm just going to paste that link that I just copied in a moment ago. And as you can see, it's going to just pull me right in there with the green screen. Notice it's not flipped like it was in the OBS Ninja from our web browser. And that's it. You can see the quality even zoomed in. Looks pretty good. It looks pretty comparable to what you're seeing right here out of VC Face directly. So not too bad. Now if you want to load this in, you're going to want to go ahead and add a chroma key. So that way you can remove the background. I chose a green background and I have green in my outfit, which is unfortunate. But you can get the idea here that uh, you just need to crank up the sensitivity and the smoothing and kind of get the right levels for you. And now you can see that our background is gone. We have the transparency. Although it's not perfect, we do have the transparency there. And that's all you need for that. So let's say you want to use this for streaming and you want to send that link over to your friends or you want to have your friends send their link over to you. You just paste that in and you just add them in. And there you go. So on the right side, you've got me coming straight out of VC Face. On the left there, that's the feed coming from OBS Ninja. You can see the latency is pretty low. There's really not much of a delay at all. A few milliseconds, maybe. So let's kind of make this a little more practical so I don't have to be here talking to myself. I'm going to get a link from my friend Lasana. And I'm going to take that same browser source I just made. But I'm going to paste in her link instead of my own link. Because I don't just want to be talking to myself. I want my friends in here. So there she is. Keep in mind it's still got the same chroma key settings. I'm not making the extra adjustments to make her look perfect for this video. But there she is. It'll be good. Ready to go. A little sway you got going. Yeah. We sway it. We sway it. And we're interacting. We're swaying. We're having a good time. Basically, you share the link, you add that link into your browser source, and you're ready to roll. So I hope this was helpful for you. If it was, please give me a thumbs up. If it was not, give me a thumbs down. If you want to see more like this, please subscribe, and I will catch you guys in the next video. See ya.
T-pose. <laughs> T-pose for dominance. Alright, alright. You win. 